hello everyone welcome again to this youtube channel so this is the fifth video from the series how we can do visual testing using apti tools so if you have not watched the four videos just go and watch those videos because this video is continuation of all those four videos okay so today we are going to cover that what exactly is the workflow of apti tools how exactly apti tools work how step by step you can test the app, uh, application using apply tools so let's talk about the workflow so this is the basic workflow most of the visual testing tools share so in the first step tool is going to drive the application under test and take screenshots these screenshots are referred as baseline images so baseline images defines the expected appearance of the application and in most of the cases these screenshots are taken in the past and approved by tester and in the second step tool is going to again take the screenshot and compare it with the baseline images and in the third step tool is going to generate a report on the basis of comparison between the screenshots taken recently and baseline images and in the fourth step tester is going to look into a report and see if there are any visual differences and has to decide if it is a valid bug or if it is a valid change that is expected in the application and if it is valid bug tester can raise uh, that, that issue in any of the application that they are using and if it is a valid expected behavior then he has to update the screenshot so that it can be used as a baseline in subsequent run so if i say it in, in a nutshell first time whenever you are going to run a test you will not have anything to compare so that's why tool is going to take a screenshots and in the second test you are going to again take a screenshots and compare it with the baseline images so that's how it works and if we talk about apply tools so that was the workflow of most of the visual testing tool but if we talk about specifically apply tools so you can clearly see you have web application that is running on some environment and then you have apply tools sdk it is going to capture the screenshots where, wherever you have put the checkpoints and uh, then in the second run it is going to compare those and going to give you report or whatever the visual differences is so that's how the workflow of apply tools is so that's all from this video guys if you like the video if you like the series please uh, comment and if you have any session, please do comment. Thank you.